So a few days ago, a Masters of the Universe teaser dropped. It is going to be coming to Netflix. I'm a little excited, um, but hesitantly excited. I used to love Masters of the Universe when I was a kid. I had a crush on He-Man. I thought he was so cool. And, you know, but looking back on the the cartoon now, obviously it's it doesn't have the same effect. Like it's not, I, I can see, it's just compared to a lot of the animation, present day animation, it, it kind of, to me, it kind of falls short, but I have a soft spot in my heart for this series because I used to enjoy it so much when I was younger, whenever I had a chance to watch it. So I'm curious to see where they're going to go with this, if it's going to be something that's going to respect the source material, the original source material, or if they're going to butcher it up like so many remakes and reboots and stuff do to the original source material, which is why a lot of times they don't necessarily do as well because they're so disrespectful to the original source material in different ways. So I don't know what they're going to, you know, what this is going to be like, but let's just go ahead and see. The title of it is called Revelation. And I don't know if it's going to be a series or a movie. But maybe we'll find out. Time after time you try to take this castle, but you will never succeed, <clears throat> Skeletor. Call your champion. I like the animation. Ooh. Tila looks cool. I recognize a lot of these characters. I mean, all the ones. I have the power! Oh, oh, him. I need a hero. Okay. <laughs> When's it coming? Whoa. Okay. All right. I'm impressed with that. I'm, I'm quite impressed with that. That animation was gorgeous. I love that. And the characters are recognizable. I recognized everybody it showed. The sorceress, I'm trying to remember all their names. There was the Tila, the sorceress, Man-at-Arms, uh, Skeletor. Gosh, I can't remember Skeletor's evil female sidekick. Shoot. I forget her name, but I recognized her. And then Orko. I think it was Orko, the little dude with the hat, um, and Battle Cat. So this looks this looks very impressive. Now they say part one, but I don't know if they mean part one of a movie or part one of a series, like you know, like how they did with the Selena series, where they had two seasons or two parts and each one had multiple episodes. I guess we'll find out as time draws near, but I will certainly be watching this probably sooner than later, unless I start to hear rumblings that it's, it's something that's gone really off the rails. But honestly, so far, it looks really impressive. Like I said, animation is gorgeous. The way they put this trailer together to get to this point was only a minute and 22 seconds, but it felt like they packed so much into it. But the way they put it together, especially with that music, that Bonnie Tyler song, I thought I'd heard mention of that song being used in this trailer. It really kind of pumped you up. Like I got really excited uh, as, as it was playing. I just like, oh, just so the anticipation. Um, so yeah, I'm in a better mood now than I was when I first started watching videos tonight. I had seen a couple trailers before I watched this and I was just not feeling it. And I didn't know if it was just a mood I was in because, you know, sometimes you just, some days you're just not in the best of moods. And I didn't know if it was that or if it was just 
the the trailers that I was watching, they just weren't grabbing me. And I just, but this one really made me happy. So I'm glad I took the time to watch it. There's at least two other trailers that I'm going to try to check out. Um, I actually got started a little early-ish on the trailer watching. So I've got some time. But wow, this one has really pumped me up and I look forward to it. So it's a little bit more than a month to go. So we don't have too much longer to wait. And I'm expecting that another or, you know, a more fully fleshed out trailer will become available to us probably in the coming weeks. Well, I shouldn't say probably because it, it surely will. That's usually how Netflix does. So, okay, well. I don't have anything else to add. I'm wrapping it up for this one, you guys. Later. Later.